really difficult to put into words the feelings that I've got for you, Sam. Then I figured it's not really about what I say, it's about what I do. And you make me do new things and amazing things every day. I never used to ski before meeting you and now I ski with you. I really don't like running, but I ran a half marathon with you. I never wanted a dog, but I want a dog with you. <laughs> and I was even prepared to do a Bollywood dance with you, but thankfully that's been cut. <laughs> But I think a lot of people have advised me that marriage is about compromise, but, but Sam, whenever I do anything with you, it never feels like a compromise. So, please, let's have a toast to my new wife. Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and a very warm welcome to Offley Place and to the wedding ceremony of JDIP and Samantha. On behalf of JDIP and Samantha I would like to thank all of you for being here as they celebrate the beginning of a new chapter in their lives. I know it means a great deal to them that you can all be here to share in their happiness and to witness this important and special occasion. JDIP and Samantha, the purpose of marriage is that you may always love, care for and support each other throughout the joys and sorrows of life. Today you will exchange vows of marriage which will unite you as a married couple. These vows are a promise of lifelong commitment, giving your families and friends the opportunity to meet together in celebration of your happiness and to impart their own messages of love and support to you both. Darling, you're with me, always around me. Only love me, only love me. Darling, I feel you under my body. Only love me, only love me. Give me shelter, or show me heart. Come on, love me, come on, love me. Watch me fall apart, watch me fall apart. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, on behalf of Mita, Selesh, Lorraine and myself, I'd like to welcome you to this, the wedding reception of JD and Samantha. The event is of course delayed, but I think you will all agree with me that it's been well worth the wait for this fantastic venue and this fantastic event. Uh, the wedding of your only daughter is always a very special moment for any father. Um, I stand here today extremely proud of Samantha. She's remarkably passionate about everything she does. She loves family, she loves to travel, and any task she's, she either chooses or assigned, she will complete. Darling, you're with me, always around me. Only love, my only love. Darling, I feel you under my body. I just wanted to firstly say, wow, what a day. From the beautiful ceremony, the live music, to the detail on the flowers, and to most importantly, the stunning new Mrs. Desai and the handsome Mr. Desai. If I think of a word or phrase to describe Sam, other than beautiful, amazing, and successful, it would be free spirit. Many of you may or may not know this about Sam, but she has been known to be quite the adventurer, from bungee jumping, to diving with sharks, to sledging down an active volcano, to exploring many different countries on her own. How long will I love you? stars above you and longer if I can how long will I need you as long as the seasons need after a few years the day came when JD inquired as to my opinion on him asking Samantha to marry him it's that day you can't quite really prepare for and you've got some funny tough messages in your head that you think you're going to deliver. And I thought about it 
and I probably only thought about it for 30 seconds and I said he makes her happy and I don't think you could ask for any more in any partner than somebody that makes you happy so it was very very easy for me to give my blessing to, to this day. From meeting JD I knew he was the one for Sam, her prince and happily ever after. Their personalities complement each other in every way imaginable. JD loves to cook and he's very proactive. Sammy loves to be pampered and to be catered for. <laughs> and longer by far. I think, Sam, to be truthful, you've really transformed JD. Uh, he seems so much happier with you in his life. And I think he's not really a man to talk about his feelings, as you probably just heard. But J JD really, really cares about you and loves you. I've seen him, when you've reached your greatest achievements and the pride and joy of, in his face, when you completed the marathon, I've seen him talk about you and your life together. And he is so happy, so thank you for coming into his life. I would like to congratulate JD as I hand over the baton of that ultimate care and responsibility. You should be congratulated because you have just married a bilingual, well-traveled, well-educated, professionally qualified, beautiful athlete, <laughs> my daughter Samantha. Yeah, I think it's funny that you talk about when I asked for your blessing in marriage, and I want to talk about the same, actually. Uh, just thinking about it makes me sweat again, going back to that time. But I seem to remember it slightly differently, I think, to how you did. But, um, but um, as I was sort of, you know, making my case and had my PowerPoint slides just about to come out, but Gary did sort of stop me and made it very clear that he would support Sam through absolutely everything. So, even if it was marrying me. <laughs> Gentlemen, can you all please stand for the bridal party? So take my hand, take my whole life too, for I can't help falling in love with I'd like to officially welcome JD to the Philips Sapp family and wish Samantha all the best as she joins her new and wonderful Desai family.
I call upon these persons here present. I call upon these persons here present. To witness that I. To witness that I. Jadip Desai. Jadip Desai. Do take thee. Do take thee. Samantha Chelsea Phillips. Samantha Chelsea Phillips. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. And Samantha, repeat these words after me. I call upon these persons here present. I call upon these persons here present. To witness that I. To witness that I. Samantha Chelsea Phillips. Samantha Chelsea Phillips. Do take thee. Do take thee. Jadip Desai. Jadip Desai. To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. I think that deserves a round of applause. Firstly, I'd like to welcome Sam to the family. But it's, it's strange, isn't it, welcoming Sam to the family? We've, we've known her for the past four years. Jadip and Sam have been inseparable. Um, you are part of the family, so it's, well, welcome, but you're already there, so. You're, a, you're incredibly warm, kind, and incredibly laid back. And yeah, you're a wonderful person, and I guess you have to be incredibly laid back to put up with, um, put up with Jadip, so. I also want to thank all of the people who put the extra special effort into sort of helping set up all the different things here today. Um, the little mini in, uh, Indian decorations and things, shifting stuff back and forth between vans. Really appreciate all of it, particularly the beautiful bridesmaids. Now, on to my own parents. <laughs> um, yeah, mum and papa, I think, you know, you've, you've literally, you know, you've given us everything we could possibly ask for in life. Samantha, I give you this ring. Samantha, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our love. As a symbol of our love. All that I am. All that I am. I give to you. I give to you. All that I have. All that I have. <laughs> Was that supposed to be the pause? So sorry, we'll just continue now. I share with you. I share with you. <laughs> I promise to love, cherish and respect you. I promise to love, cherish and respect you. In times of joy. In times of joy. And in times of sorrow. And in times of sorrow. From this day forward. From this day forward. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. Place that ring firmly down. Oh, that's lovely. That's never coming off, is it? It's <laughs> that's lovely. Jadip, I give you this ring. Jadip, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our love. As a symbol of our love. All that I am. All that I am. I give to you. I give to you. All that I have. All that I have. I share with you. I share with you. I promise to love, cherish and respect you. I promise to love, cherish and respect you. In times of joy. In times of joy. And in times of sorrow. And in times of sorrow. From this day forward. From this day forward. For as long as we both shall live. For as long as we both shall live. If you place that firmly down. Oh, certainly it's not coming. Going on. <laughs> all going on. There we go. That's lovely. <laughs> Did those two little boys swap those rings? Did, did you swap those rings? And Samantha, 
Samantha, you have made the declarations prescribed by law and you have made solemn and binding marriage vows with each other in the presence of your guests, witnesses and the registrar of marriages. You have sealed those vows with the giving and receiving of wedding rings and in addition you have given to each other a promise of a lifelong commitment. Jadip and Samantha, it now gives me great pleasure to pronounce you as husband and wife. And Jadip, in the time on tradition, do you want to give your lovely wife a kiss? 